Yo, what is up there, guys? As always, back at it again for another video. And that is right, we are continuing on the countdown till D23 Japan Kingdom Hearts fan event. And that's what we're going to be doing right here, right now. So let's get right to it. Okay, so for today's topic, I wanted to go ahead and talk about Monsters Hank and Big Hero 6. So, as you all know, we are most likely expecting a brand new trailer for the Kingdom Hearts D23 fan event. And it wouldn't be a trailer without, of course, showing off some worlds. Now, I mentioned Big Hero 6 mainly because, you know, it has been quite a while since we have seen that world. Actually, we haven't really seen anything except for that one concept art that we got, and that was all the way back in 2015. But when you go ahead and think about it right now, you know, this D23 is happening in Japan, and as you know, Big Hero 6 World is San Francisco, and as you all know, San Francisco is basically a mixture of San Francisco and Tokyo. And again, seeing as how the event is being held in Japan, it would kind of make a lot of sense to finally go ahead and show off that world. They can basically go ahead and did what they did with the Toy Story world world where they basically showed off like you know Hercules first and then they went ahead and revealed the brand new world that being Toy Story so with this trailer maybe they can go ahead and start off with Big Hero 6 show us some of that gameplay show us the party members maybe they could go ahead and end it off with like you know seeing Sora riding on top of Baymax getting ready to go ahead and fight the evil Baymax now the reason why I mentioned like you know just show me some of the gameplay just show me some of the world is because if you go ahead and think about it when it comes to the Hercules world we've seen that in like almost every single trailer but yeah we have never had a proper introduction or cutscene involving Sora and Hercules so that's why I say like you know with Big Hero 6 they can just go ahead and show us some of the gameplay and all this stuff basically treat Big Hero 6 the way they've been treating Hercules I would love to see like you know a full-fledged cutscene but I'm okay with just getting a look at the world itself and from there we do the whole if you can imagine a world just dive in and boom we can go ahead and jump straight into Monsters Inc now I have a feeling as though it might be Monsters Inc mainly because as we all know, we have seen leaked images and all that stuff, and I mainly want to see Monsters, Inc., just so we can put these leaks to rest. I mean, again, they might be fake, but my personal opinion after reviewing all the screenshots and everything, seeing Boo, seeing the Unverse, seeing the designs for, like, you know, Sora, Goofy, and Donald, the world to me is pretty legit, and I can't see it being fake, so I think now would be a really great time to reveal that world. Mainly one, again, to finally put these leaks to rest, and also if you were to reveal a Pixar world, I I think the best place to go ahead and do that would be at D23, which is of course the biggest Disney event of all time. And again, just going back to all the leaks that we've seen, again, the images were a little bit rough, things are kind of sketchy, but again, looking at it, it, we can definitely tell that this was an early stage in development. The pictures that we got, we saw all the coding, showing that like, you know, a reminder to go back and replace this face later on. And just looking at Kingdom Hearts 3 stories overall, uh, Monsters Inc. would be a nice addition to the game itself. I mean, think about it, Monsters Inc. Might might be the first time where we actually see the Unverse. Maybe Monsters Inc. is going to be one of the last worlds that we go ahead and visit, that the Unverse will appear after we go ahead and wake up Ventus, and when Ventus wakes up, perhaps Vanitas will be restored, and then, you know, that's when the Unverse are coming in, making a mess in the Monsters Inc. world. So again, I just think the Monsters Inc. would be a great addition to Kingdom Hearts 3. It's definitely got some story elements, you know, friendship and all that stuff. Not to mention, it would be our second Pixar world. If they added a third one, oh my god, I'm going to absolutely lose my mind and if monsters inc does end up being revealed man i feel kind of bad for square because this would have been an insane surprise but like you know once i see that trailer i'm not gonna really be too shocked except the only thing that it's gonna make me lose my mind is finally seeing sora's face because throughout all these monsters inc leaks the only thing that we have yet to actually see is sora's face that's really the only surprise thing that i'm probably gonna get so guys that is basically it for this video discussion right over here again I feel as though Big Hero 6 does have the potential of being showcased with all the gameplay and all that stuff, and the big world reveal will indeed be Monsters, Inc. So guys, what I want to know in the comment section below is, you know, what do you think? Do you think we will see Big Hero 6 at the D23 Japan Kingdom Hearts fan event? Do you think Monsters, Inc. is going to be the brand new world that is revealed? So guys, leave all your comments in the comment section below, and if you liked this video, make sure to give it a big thumbs up, as that really helps me out, and until next time, guys, I'm gonna go ahead and say, bye, pal, who will see ya? real soon. <laughs>